All I can do is say is, wow, we lost another game. Three games in a row. At least we, uh, we won game behind Jacksonville. Look like, um, people was right. Look like we're going to have to go, um, 10 and, uh, and 7. We got to go win the next three games. We got to have to blow out for Texas and Tennessee. Then we come back on Thursday night and uh and play the Cowboys on the 29th, and that's next week. And we play Jacksonville Sunday at 1 o'clock. And we definitely need to win that game. So we become 10 and 7. So those are the next three games that Titans will definitely need to win. And we don't need to hear Jacksonville name all the time. But this is war. We got to keep Brian Tannehill upright. We got to fix that offensive line. These injuries been killing us for a long time. And it's just, it just is not looking good for us. And I hopefully that we're, we're going to make the playoffs. I'm not saying that we're not going to make the playoffs. We want to make the playoffs. We got to get that running game going. We can't just only pitch your Derrick Henry and get rid of Todd, Todd Downey. You know what I'm saying? It's not his fault. You know, we got to still have that faith to push the ball down the field, throw it, and have a shot. So I hopefully by next week, Trayon, we get Trayon Burks back really fast because I don't care what y'all say. Trayon Burks is like the next A.J. Brown. But Trayon Burks is going to be a little bit better. But I like with uh, Ray, uh, Reggie, 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 uh, I think this name Reggie. Yeah, his name Reggie, the cornerback, number 21. I like what he did today. So if he progressed more than I'll say, he should get an uh, interception for the next three weeks of the Titans need to win a 10 and 7. So it look like we're going to go 10 and 7. So, you know, it doesn't. Like I said, that game was crazy. I'm thinking that I don't know why Waver missed that. That tackle, he got to contain that side, and that's why when he, uh, when Joe, when well not Joe, but uh, Justin Herbert, when he went to his left, no, he went to his right. I mean, he scrambled to his right, and uh, Waver should have had that that right side shut down. You know, I miss her Landry a lot. I'm not even going to even sugarcoat the game anything. I really miss that man a lot. Like. He's one of our best pass rushers. You know, I Mike Vrabel, I, I know he's going to fix it. You know, he's going to win a Super Bowl for the Tennessee Titans. He got, what, 10 years or a seven-year contract with us. So he's not going nowhere for a long time. Todd Downey, we're not going to miss the playoff this year. We're going to the playoffs. By next week, we're going to start winning games. Mm-hmm. And then we beat. Houston, Texas, in Tennessee, that's going to be good. Then Thursday night, we're going to have to beat the Dallas Cowboys. We beat the Dallas Cowboys to shut Michael Irvin them up, we'll be good. And then go on the road to beat Jacksonville. If we go on the road to beat Jacksonville, we are good. You know what I'm saying? We can't just sit here and focus on other teams, give other teams, give other players their props and all the other stuff. We got to stop doing that. We got to give us more confidence in ourselves in the next three games. You know, you know, Trevor Lawrence, just because he beat the Dallas Cowboys and stuff, that doesn't mean anything. We want to see Jacksonville again anyway. So, King Henry, he will get his last lap against Jacksonville and stuff. So, like I said, we're going to we're going to we're going to the playoffs. Look like we're going to we want to still get that four seed. You know, we want to keep that four seed locked, and we ain't going nowhere. Like I said, you know, we're just going to keep our head up, Titans fans. So, like, uh, you know, this this does not look good for for us today. But like I said, we got to move on, go forward, and focus on the Houston Texans next week. You know, because I know that we're going to get a win next Saturday.
at one o'clock in Nashville. So, you know, it just, this game would just, the defense, if 32, if he would just turn around and look for the ball, because when you, you got to, when you playing corner, man, you got to backpedal. Then you react. You read the quarterback. You backpedal, backpedal. Then you read the quarterback. And then you jump right in front of But We got to get some turnovers, man. That's been killing us, man. Injury thing. That's the number one key. We have to get healthy. We're going to need DeMarco Archery for the next three games. We're going to need him badly, badly. And we're going to need Zach Cunningham badly. So it look like we ain't gonna be get Dave along until the playoffs. And but I see in us by next week we're gonna get Zach Cunningham, Darius, I mean DeMarco Archery back. And we're gonna need those guys back fast. You know, and we're gonna need Kristen Fulton back next week. So we're going to need all our healthy players back next week. And Malik Hooker. We're going to need everybody back to beat the, the Houston Texans. Then we got to face another good team. Then we got to play the Cowboys. Then we got to go on the road and beat freaking Jacksonville. So we become 10 and 7. And like I said, like that's going to be our record right there. Man, whoever we play in a, in a wild card spot, we're going to have to beat them. And whoever we play in the division, we're going to have to beat them. Go into the AFC championship, and so these people can shut up. Because I have a good feeling that we're going to win the next three games so we can be 10 and 7. We be 10 and 7, and we go into the wild card, and we beat three good teams, three good teams in the playoffs. Then you, that's when we said something about ourselves. But I just, like I said, I have a bad feeling that we're going to win this division. And I'm not jinxing my team. And we just going to have to win the next three games. That's why I got. I got faith that we're going to win the next three games. And then we're going to go to the wild card. And then show off, be a lot of good teams, then make it to the Super Bowl. And I'm still keeping my hopes up. Never going to keep my hope down because I don't care about what these haters say about my Tennessee Titans. I don't care about what Michael Michael Irvin say. I don't care about what Ryan Clark say. I'm hearing y'all with y'all talking bad about my Tennessee Titans. It's okay. But by next Saturday and stuff, you're going to um, – and then when the Titans uh, win next Saturday, then – um. You're going to see me, and then I'm going to make fun of all y'all haters that who doubted us and stuff. So when we do win a Super Bowl 57, we're going to get the last laugh. Watch. You'll see. And then when it happens, then you'll be upset. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting tired of all the negativity that people keep putting the Tennessee Titans down and stuff. Talking about, oh, we are not a good football team and all this stuff. Talking bad about the organization. I know that we got rid of John Robinson, but the team don't need to have no excuse. And we need to not to have no more excuse and go in next week to beat the Texas. You know, they yeah, shoot. They almost beat the dad going um the Chiefs today. I was shocked, but hey, that long as I knocked off back off the Patriots today and all those other teams a little bit, we good. But right now, we're going to have to win the next three games so we can be 10 and 7. So you hit the uh, subscribe button and hit the like button and all that other stuff. You know what I'm saying? Give me thumbs up, whatever. Give me um 1,000 subscribers or a million subscribers, whatever. Make sure you watch all my YouTube channels and stuff. And like I said, Tennessee Titans, we're going to have to keep our head up. You know what I'm saying? We don't need to fire nobody. We need to look at our look in ourselves in the mirror. For the next six days, we need to look ourselves in the mirror and say we got to win the next three games. Because the next three games is a must game win. Because I know Jacksonville play uh the Jets Thursday night. So I'm gonna need those dumb Jets to beat 
Jacksonville, so the so so the Titans could be two games. So when they lose, and Jacksonville be two games behind the Titans, you know. So, but like I said, hit that like button, Titans fans. I'm gonna come on with some more videos, maybe tomorrow. Let's just see how this whole week gonna go. But I'll make some new videos and stuff. Probably um make some new videos tomorrow or or on Saturday, whatever. It depends how I feel. But right now, <laughs> I gotta go to work and stuff. And I work from home, so I got my own job business and stuff. Cause this YouTube channel is crazy with crazy people. But like I said, let's just let's just do us. You know what I'm saying? Titans, like I said, for the next six days, Titans fans, let's just stir ourselves in the mirror and tell ourselves that we can make it to the Super Bowl. That's our that's the goal right there, to make it to the Super Bowl. You know? We have to to push this this situation and and kill these haters with kindness and stuff. Cause this season has not been going our way at all. You know what I'm saying? We lost three games. The next three games we're gonna have to win. Like I said, beat the Texas next next Saturday, one o'clock. Then we got Thursday night at eight fifteen to to beat the Cowboys at home because we're gonna wear our code blue. And go in there in the next three weeks and, and beat the heck out of uh Jacksonville, you know, because they ain't going to call themselves Saxonville no more now. We're going to get them. We're going to get all these three teams. We're going to meet one of them teams in the playoffs that, that beat us. But when that happens, I'm going to be excited, you know. But, but like I said, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button and everything. Give me one million subscribers on one of my videos. Help me out and stuff. And boost up all my videos for me. You know what I'm saying? Like and share these videos and all of them. And especially this one. So, like I said, hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. And give me one million the views and stuff so I can get paid. You know what I'm saying? Like this button. Hit me up, Titans fans. Tell me what you think today. Be honest with yourself. We can't get rid of the tar down and everybody else. You know what I'm saying? Tighten up. I'm out.